up, Simone? Good. My name is Curtis Cook Jr. And, and you're, you're watching, watching Cal TV. TV. Can you tell us a little bit about your characters in the movie? Well, the character I play is Camilla. <laughs> and she has a relationship between these two Korean brothers. And also her family, they, they're they not really, they don't really have the relationship with the Korean brothers as much as I like them. I play Keith in the movie. I take on the responsibility of the household after our parents are no longer in the picture. And yeah, we do have a relationship with the two Korean uh, boys, young men, that she likes to go sneak off with. And it's, a, it's, a interesting, it's an interesting dynamic between us. And both of your characters are very powerful, very emotional. How did you get into the, your character? Getting into it, uh, just putting yourself in the time period as much as possible, listening to the music. Music is a big thing, man. Music is a big thing to really represent the time that you're in, man. Uh, and the language, how, how people move, how people groove, how people just walk, you know, you walk to a rhythm. So yeah, just putting myself in that and then seeing how I can connect some of the situations with situations in my life. I didn't have the exact same situation, but I found enough <laughs> something underneath that I could find how it connected together. So lastly, this film tackled social issues with racism and of course diversity, especially in the industry. So what do you hope the audience will take away from after watching this film? I hope they take away that it's, it's just because of what you are, like let's say if you're Korean, African American, Caucasian, whatever, doesn't, doesn't necessarily mean that you should be placed in a category or something like, oh, you know how sometimes people say, oh, Caucasians are regularly rich or something. Yeah. That is not true. Oh, that is not true. I mean, sometimes there are homeless Caucasians on the street. It's not just about the race. People could be placed in different situations other than just what you think their situation is. I'm going to keep saying it. I'm saying it in all my interviews. It's gonna, I think it's going to help lead us closer to empathy, and that's, that's a catalyst for some change, I think. You heard it here. Thank you so much for joining us. Thank, Thank you. you so much. Hi, I'm Lauren Oliver, and you're watching CalTV.